Guests can be created for ad hoc remote contributions within the Quick Link Manager. Creating a guest invite will send an instant temporary account link via email, WhatsApp, SMS, or by generating a link for sharing through any messaging medium. Once you're logged into your portal, in order to invite a guest, click on your account name in the top left, come down to Invite Guest, that will open up the Guest Invite window. So for a single invite, all you need to do is fill out the form here. So we start with the guest's name. And if you're sending the invite via email, just put in their email address here. You can also change the contents of the email at the bottom if you wish to send a personalized message. There we go. You can also send it via WhatsApp if you'd prefer. So just put their telephone number in instead. And the same applies to the SMS feature as well. You can also, as I mentioned before, create a link if you'd prefer to do that. So you can set the expiry time and hours very quickly and easily here as well. You just put in something like eight hours or however many hours you like. Or you can use the calendar feature here. So you could set up uh, the guest invite in advance and then have that ready to go for next week or something like that. The other thing to look at here is assisted mode. So if you have this checked here, basically the guests will be run through some checks and tests when they follow the link to your portal. It will make sure that they've got their camera, their microphone and their speakers working. It will also run some tests on their device and their network to check that it's suitable for joining the call. So once you're happy with all the settings here, you can simply click send. And you see for this option, I've created a link so I can go ahead and copy the link and distribute that as I wish. Now, the other way to invite guests is to do a bulk invite. So we will open up the guest invite window the same way, clicking on our account name, coming to invite guest. And here we are in the guest invite window. So instead of single invite, we're just going to click bulk invite. So this will prompt you to download a CSV template file. I've already got one here. So I'm just going to show you an example that I have prepared. Now, when you first open this, if you do open it in Excel, you will need to make sure that the formatting is correct and it looks exactly the same as it would do in the invite that I've just shown you. So this example, I've created three guests here. I put in an email for the first one, WhatsApp telephone number for the second one, and then telephone number for SMS for the third one. You'll see that I have the year, the month, the day, and then the time here. So it has to look like that with the dashes. You can't have any forward slashes or anything like that. You can also put text here as well. So you put your text here. And then if you want assisted mode on, you just put true in this box or leave it blank. The other way that you can fill out this CSV file is via notepad. So you see, I've got an example here. Basically, when you open the template first time, you'll see this top row here and it will tell you what you need to put in between the commas. So you see, I've filled out all the details within the commas here. If you prefer that way, you can do it that way. That's equally as acceptable. So once you're ready to upload your CSV file, all you need to do is click browse or you can drag it in. So I'm just going to select my bulk invite CSV, click open. And you see that I've got my three guests have appeared in here. So it's really quick and easy to do that. The first one, you see, got an email ready. Second one, I prepared a WhatsApp phone number, so I can just click that here. There you go. And third one was SMS. See, that's all in there. You can make any changes if you decide that you'd like that to be a bit longer. Or I didn't put assisted mode on this person. I can change it here now. So once you're happy with all these, you just go ahead and click send all. And there we go. I've just invited all those guests to my portal. Thank you for watching. You can access other instruction videos on our YouTube channel or by navigating to support.quicklink.tv.